Hi everyone! Today we're going to draw a dragon together. I'm going to show you a way to draw with simple shapes that hopefully will make it a little bit easier. I'm going to draw a dragon the opposite of the one you see on the page. The nose will be facing the other direction. First, I'm going to draw a circle for the main part of the head. Draw it lightly so you can erase it later. Then, I'm going to draw a U shape for the rest of the snout. Finally, we can finish the main part of the dragon with large rainbow shapes for the neck. It looks a little bit like a horse right now. So we need to add some horns or antlers, whatever you think looks good. Let's add two rainbow lines coming out from the top of the head and the middle of the head. We can make a curve U-shape at the top and draw downward to finish the horns. On this dragon, maybe I'll make it a little bit different from my first one and add an ear. You can draw a line up, curved, and down. It almost looks like a little bat wing. For the eye, let's move to the center of the first circle that we drew and draw a rainbow shape going up and then a U shape. Side of that shape, let's draw two more U shapes and then color in the space in between. Leaving a white highlight in the eye makes it look a little more lively. Let's get rid of our extra circle. We don't need it anymore. The circle gave us a good start, but now the lines are just in the way. We need to follow the line down from the eye for the nostril, and we can fill it in a little bit. The other nostril we can't see, so let's just draw a bump so we know that it's there. And the same for the other eye. Let's draw a little bump so we know there's an eye on the other side of the face. These eye ridges and nose ridges will make the dragon look a little more 3D. Let's give your dragon a pointy nose and a happy crooked smile. You can draw U's up and down to make the smile. And then for the jaw, make it nice and sharp. You can add some spikes to the jaw, or whiskers to the dragon, whatever you like. It's your dragon. On the front of the neck, let's draw a line with some V-shapes to show that cool armor plating. To make the horns look more textured, we can add some quick curving lines. Make the lines curved, not straight, so the horns look round. If the lines are straight, it won't look round. You could add a few extra spikes if you like. And then finally finish off your dragon with a little bit of shading. You can shade under each little spike. shade the bottom of the horns. You can shade a little bit under the chin, just lightly with your pencil, and underneath the ridges inside the ears, maybe a little bit behind the add 
anything you want. It's your dragon. So you can add spikes, wings, whiskers, whatever makes you happy. Thanks for giving it a try. Maybe you can draw a lot of different dragons and even color them in. See you next time!